Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It is Super Cali here, bringing you guys another episode of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt, and we are going to help Siri with her business in Novigrad. Right here. Looking right for now. something in particular? Um, a pretty little trinket. Want to give someone a present? One of the people I told you about. A gesture of gratitude. Can we go? Sure. Lead the way. We'll start with the bits. Who are we gonna visit? You'll see. I don't like when people say you'll see. Like, it's like I have a feeling it's not gonna be someone we wanna Almost see. There. Where are we going exactly? To see Horse and Junior. Yep, see. Wait, that's not the way to Horse and I thought we killed Horse and Junior. Did we not kill him? I don't... Wrong direction. Horson's headquartered on Temple Isle. So I thought. But I think we should check something first. Zoltan claims the word in town is we're more likely to run into Horson around here. Why are you doing this again? I want to look him in the eyes. What then? Oh wait, no. Did we spare him? Because we had a choice, right? We could spare him or we could kill him. Did we spare him or kill him? I don't... I don't remember what happened anymore. Not what I thought I'd find. And there he is. I guess we spared him. Junior wasn't a pious man. But there came a moment when he prayed to all the gods at once, for his life. Since the gods disliked Junior, they granted his prayer. Years later, he had just one regret, that at the moment in question, he hadn't surrendered to death, for he had had the courage then to do so, courage he would never have again. Wonder what happened to him? We'll soon find out. Who? Who's that? Remember me? You. You can. <laughs> you little ass fucked whore. You. You pay for what you did to me. He can I'd watch your words if I were you. Stand up. Witcher! It's all your fault. Happy? You cocksucker. Not left. Not a bloody scrap. Human dignity left. No! <laughs> Little shit! <laughs> We're just gonna leave him there? On the way here, I didn't know what I'd do. Killing him was definitely an option. Still want to? No. This is worse. True. Let's go. We've done the hardest. This part. is where we kept him alive in the first place. Only the I think. bits left now. Where are we going? The Golden Sturgeon. A girl who works there helped me. Look! Look! What an interesting first name, though. This girl we're going to see. Who is she again? Friend of Dandelions. Her name's B. She's a waitress at the Golden Sturgeon. Helped me contact Dandelion. I wish to thank her. She risked a lot. Risked a lot? How's that? The devil guard would be breathing down my neck. If she'd been seen with me, she might have been flogged or worse. Always getting into trouble. I take after you. <laughs> so true. So many ways that she take after girl. Gave you a chance. Should have taken it. I spit on anything you give me. You'll regret that, you cow. Mind your manners. You're talking to a lady. Stay out of this. This is not your concern. 
sure it is. You're a fucking freak too. He is. Very dangerous at that. The butcher of White Orchard. What'd he do there? Trim the trees? Yugen. He slew half the village. Dragged the bodies of the alderman and his wife behind his horse to Novigrad. Let's get out of here. That's pretty good advice your friend's offering. <laughs> Sorry. Now he's scared. Bitches. Thank you. I seem more determined this time. You shouldn't cross them, I told you. I'm to bar non-humans from this establishment because some thugs threaten me. Not likely. It's so good to see you, B. And you, Siri. Who's your charming companion? Geralt of Rivia. Oh. Geralt of Rivia. <gasps> that Geralt! <laughs> you know. Very nice to meet you. I've heard so much. What have you heard? Really? What, for example? For example, how you've saved her from woes so many times she's lost count. And how you always know how to make her laugh. That's Siri, of course. Other ladies, however. B, I'm standing right here. <laughs> all right, all right. So, what brings you here, darlings? I wanted to thank you for everything. Oh, stop. Anyone would have done the same in my shoes. Not many would have done it with such courage. Thank you. This is for you. A trinket to remember me by. Oh my, it's beautiful. Thank you. So, will you stay for stew? And keep slaughtered a piglet this morning? Thanks. But we must still visit Far Corners. Ah, off to see Valdo, eh? Well, shan't stop you then. They'll feed you properly there too, no doubt. Farewell to you both. And do take care of our witcher. I will. So long. Always. We will always take care of Sirena. Is that person naked? So, your friend, B. What about her? Nothing. Seems nice. Geralt. You're terrible. What'd I say? <laughs> What's what there to see in far corners? The camp of some traveling circus performers. Non-humans. When I came here before, I wanted to contact Triss. Life was hard. I quickly spent nearly everything the Baron gave me. Triss and I never met, because the Temple Guard showed up. I was a wanted woman afterwards. Triss didn't try to contact you? How could she? She didn't know anything. In fact, she thought she was to meet another alchemist wanting to flee Novigrad. I preferred not to put her in danger. I was being hunted. I had not a copper to my name. Then I met Valdo. He and his troop helped me. Then introduced me to B. And through B, I found Dandelion. You know the rest. Uh huh. Where are we going? Where's this friend of yours? There! Valdo! With the. Oh, was it with the face pain? Or? Siri! You devil incarnate! Where have you been? Come here, darling! Hello? What's this? Brought your granddad? Hagar, you're incorrigible. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia. Ah, greetings. We've heard heaps about you. Likewise, and thanks for helping Siri. Oh, we had no choice. Found it hard to refuse a lass like her. <laughs> I bet. Well, good you're here. Come in the nick of time. You would have been gone by tomorrow. You're leaving? Let us start resettling non-humans shortly. We'd rather stay ahead of events. I understand. Problem is, we just lost two horses, and another two are too weak to haul anything. Ah, we'll manage somehow. We don't leave till tomorrow, so not to worry about today. Yes, for some. I'm off to see a merchant. There's a chance I can trade our nags for a healthy horse. Wouldn't want Valdo to have anything to worry about tomorrow. Hmm. Anyway, we can help. Oh, don't fret about us. We always get by somehow. Right, Siri? What brings you here? I've come to apologize. I disappeared so suddenly, then... Ah, oh, pish posh. What matters is you're back, and you're well. This is for you. All that you loan me, plus a small premium. Siri? 
You know I can't take this. And you know I shan't let you refuse. Hmm. I know. We'll make it the pot for a wager. <laughs> Do you still race? Of course. Then I challenge you. Geralt, will you join us? Gladly. A man after my own spirit. <laughs> Come. No oh way. Geralt, choose one of these. Coming, coming. Okay. You were faster once. Giving you a head start. What about me? Faster, you're trailing. Watch where you're going or you'll fall. <laughs> Seems you've slowed. Just want to admire you from the side. <laughs> oh no, we're gonna run, run out of stamina soon. Stamina. Stamina. Why am I so bad at that <laughs> word? I don't understand. Oh, I won. <laughs> it's even like dry. Can still beat you. I let you win. Lovely race. Well, this calls for a celebration. Stay the evening. We've several barrels of Kedwin's best. Bonfires to be lit soon, round which all will gather. This night shall be ours. Uh, it's nice to have some leisurely, not so serious killing people time. More wine? Thanks. I'm glad we stayed. Me too. They like you here. I like them too. I'd love to join them. Drink and race, travel from town to town, not worry a whit about anything. Something worrying you now? <sighs> what awaits us? Defeating the hunt won't be easy, but with the Lodge's support, Avalax, we can do this. I fear fighting the hunt will only be the beginning, for me at least. What do you mean? <laughs> you promised! <laughs> In jest? Sometimes I wish I could be like them. Meaning? Ordinary. Problem is, you're not. You were born to greatness. As I've been hearing since I was born. All because of this damned elder blood. My gift. My curse. At least she doesn't I only see it as a powers, curse. But it's also why I've spent my life fleeing, hiding. Then it's time to end this. Once we defeat Eredin, you'll be free. Really? Eredin's hardly alone. There are others. They have plans for me. It was the sorceresses of the Lodge once. Now it's my father. Even Yennefer. You're forgetting Avalach. Avalach's different. He is intent on my gift not falling into the wrong hands. Not spinning out of control. It's why he teaches me, protects me. I hope you're right. If you say so. You doubt it? There'll come a day when Avalach will ask you for a favor. Perhaps. But if so, it will be a very, very long time from now. And I'm certain whatever it is, he'll give me a choice. I will have the option to refuse. Hope you're right. <laughs> That's Pablo. I plan to learn how to juggle one day. Incredibly useful skill. Finally found you two. Enjoying yourselves. Bonfires, wine, jugglers. What more could you ask for? I could name a few things I'd trade it for, but it's a life. You seem concerned. Things not go well with the merchant. Ha, lost cause. 
The man refused to trade. I said I'd buy. He asked three arms and a host of legs for one healthy animal. We need horses, but we'll have to find another way to get them. Ho, ho, I sense trouble. I knew you'd warm to the notion. We mean to sneak into the man's stable. With 30 head, a few more or less won't make a difference in his life. Coming with? Of course. Hmm. Let's steal some horses. Uh, what can I do? Gotta help those in need. Yes, yes, yes! Must say, you didn't seem the type to me. What type? Steady. Time to go. We'll meet by the stables. I'm not steady? Rude. This episode is like all cutscene stuff and like running around. Hagar, keep a lookout. Siri and I'll try to get inside. All right. Wait here. I'll go inside. Open the door for you. Just keep the noise down. A big boss. Hard to find good guards these days. Quiet. We'll wake them. Jesus. Um. That good. There we go. These horses are so I just took a bunch of horses. Why not steal some horses? Woohoo! We did it! Excellent work! Did you see the two fools who tried to chase us? Almost tripped over their own boots. <laughs> Thanks, Geralt. That was splendid. Yeah, a nice change from killing monsters. Thanks for your help, and for visiting. It was so good to see you all again. Hang in there, and take care of yourselves. Don't forget us. So long. I must bid Valdo farewell. All right. See you at Dandelions, then. Got some things to take care of in town. See you, girl. What things will I have to take, to take care of? Me, Yennefer, at the Lodge of Sorceresses at Dandelions Inn. Oh, and the Lodge of Sorcerers. Oh boy. We're back with our final preparations. First things first. Unlocking all the skills. Making it daytime. Because I like daytime. I'm gonna find a quick route somewhere. Where we go? Well, guys, this was definitely a different kind of uh, change of pace, you can say, from all the other episodes. This one was way more pleasing, I guess you can say. Um, we just stole some horses. We didn't have to kill anything or fight anybody. So, definitely definitely a little different but that is gonna be it for this episode of the witcher 3 wild hunt i do hope you guys enjoyed it though if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up it would mean a lot to me 
you know, etc, etc. And yeah, so the next episode we will be meeting Yennefer in the, lo in the lodge and finding out what's what's happening next. Next episode will probably be way more action-packed and probably longer. She's rude. Anyways, guys, I love you all. Be kind to one another, and I will see you in the next episode of The Witcher. Bye, guys. Bye.